Hello everybody, it is Yellowfin from Yellowfin TV and we are at a new car meet. Actually, we haven't been to this one before. This is the Fin and Tonic Exotic Car Meet. And let's just say the exotics definitely showing up. Quite a few familiar faces, also quite a few new ones as well. We got a nice purple Lamborghini Urus right here. Also the Gran Turismo spec Nissan GTR Nismo. We've seen this one a couple times at Sarasota Cars and Coffee. Now again with its wrap on it, looking really nice. Then. Lamborghini Huracan in purple, also familiar face. We've got a few poles we've seen of them leaving. Lamborghini Huracan Technica in orange. Again, another one we've seen in quite a few videos, if you've seen a couple videos in the past, but still looking really good as before. And then this is a new one. We got two nice Ferraris right here, both in that classic Ferrari red. Haven't actually seen these two Ferraris before, but we don't see too many Ferraris very often. A lot of Lambos. A lot of Bentleys, a lot of Bentleys for sure. I don't think there's too many Bentleys here, but two very nice Ferraris. And then another familiar face. We've seen this one a couple times, Sarasota Cars of Coffee. I believe at another exotic car meet. And also we've car spotted it out in public. The Lamborghini Huracan Vert with the white rims. Very nice, of course. And then also you got to have the Beamers, the M4 Comp. Another very, very nice ride for sure. Big old rims on it, carbon fiber door handles, blue calipers, looking real good, nice spec. And we got a nice little bike right there as well. Then, might have just shown you a few things, but we got a couple other things on over here. Some C8 Vets, Porsche Cayenne, Challenger. Uh, got some more Bimmers as well. C6 Vet, M4. Plus, we saw a few other ones of these rolling in as well. Like this wrapped BMW M3 and the Ferrari FF in white, another very nice Ferrari, the Wagon Ferrari. This one's super sick to see. We'll do a little zoom out right there, the 0.5. Yeah, I really like the Ferrari F actually. It's just, it's just unique. It's got like its own sort of look to it, something you wouldn't really see from Ferrari. It's not as popular, it's similar to the McLaren GT, which I also like a lot rolling out right now in orange. I believe we've seen this one before once. It just, I really like the Ferrari FF and the McLaren GT. So yeah, there, there you have it. Then G-Wagon and we got to rotate over there. We got some more stuff too. So over here, Mustang 5.0 M5 Comp, row of Dodge Challengers as well. We got some RTs, some Hellcats, a couple Hellcats actually, and a couple of RTs, all lined up very nice we've seen a few challenger lineups in our time and nice lexus as well then audi s4 is back one of the many familiar faces of the channel looking good as always he's got some new stuff on it too so it's pretty sweet to see look at that engine bay looking real good then on over here shelby stang clean dude very clean also got to see these two rolling on in two toyota crowns both imports both looking real good as well dang look at those oh he's got a big old turb ski on as well but yeah these both are just super clean builds then going back on over here we got a scat pack audi s5 and the orange mercedes has made a return we've seen that one one time before i believe it was at a carson coffee or it was maybe car spotting i can't remember which one then also we're just going down a line of soon to be supercars if we get way over there some borderline you can call them hypercars i guess i mean they're pretty fast but yeah i don't know the lines the lines get a bit blurred by that point but we got first nice merc supra Ooh, here's something i like that just pulled in got ourselves a datsun <laughs> that's sweet i heard that engine heard it right behind this little 280 sx i believe or zx yeah 280 zx dang that is sick all right, but yeah, back to what we were talking about before. We got ourselves a little Supra with carbon fiber hood, Audi R8, the slammed RS6, and the Nissan GTR Duo is back, plus the clean gray Lamborghini Gallardo. Porsche 911 as well, and the diesel BMW SUV is also here. Got a few more bikes that just pulled up right on over there. Just arrived. We got stuff just arriving and heading out all at the best time, so I thought this was probably the proper time to record nice blue gtr as well another familiar face the 370z the black one looking real good next to an audi s4 and a lincoln continental classic really clean right there that that thing's actually real sick hey it's got the white walls on it too that looks real good then another nice audi and then here's what i was talking about before a bentley we got a bentley right here i believe this one to be a flying spur 
Or is it a Mulzan? No, I'm thinking, no, I believe it's a flying spur. Yeah, that's a flying spur right there. We're, we're gonna be confident in our answer. But yeah, there is, I believe, the only Bentley of the meet, but still a pretty nice Bentley indeed. Then, going around here, got a nice Jag, another Lamborghini Huracan, C8 Corvette, Stingray R. Damn, that thing is nice. Don't believe I've seen one of those before. And we got, of course, two Tesla Cybertrucks. It wouldn't be an exotic meet without having two Cybertrucks. You don't see it too often, but when you do, you gotta, you gotta give them a look. That's for sure. You gotta give them a look. You might hate them, you might love them, but you gotta notice them. You always do. Then, very clean Cayman build right here, Porsche. That looks just so tough. Ferrari Roma, another Ferrari that we don't really see too often. I think I've car spotted more than I've actually seen at meets, but pretty cool to see one at a meet. And a familiar face, the McLaren 600 LT. That is a very nice car. Plus the Garage 1 GT Porsche as well is here. We got a nice yellow Porsche convertible right there and another Lamborghini Huracan Technica, this one being the blue one. Very sweet. Two Aston Martin DBXs, one of which is a safety car edition for the F1. Then Audi R8, another one convertible, plus non-convertible right there in white. And in between them is a very nice orange McLaren. Yes, it is a 720S looking real good in orange. Plus, we've got another 720S. Scoot on over, right on past this other very nice white Ferrari, 488. And we got a neon green 720S. There's gotta be quite a few 720Ss in Sarasota. I thought I knew all of them. There was a white one, a gray one, and there was another color I think I covered in another video, but now we got two more to add to the list. An orange one and a green one also both running around town. And then we got two insane classic builds right here. We got old Chevy truck, double twin turb skis. Well, I guess it would just be twin skirt, it's not double twin skirt skis. It's not, it's not quad, but still insane. And look at this Stang as well. Ridiculous, bro. That's absolutely, absolutely incredible. They're both super clean too. Like those are just a build and a half right there. And then what you might've seen on the thumbnail, we've got two beautiful, Lamborghini Aventadors, the Omni Energy one and an Aventador S. So we got the SVJ and the S, both amazing cars, just absolutely amazing cars. I love the Aventadors. They just look so good. And like, that's the thing, they're like kind of old now. What did they come out in like 2016? They're eight years old, but they look like they could be sold brand new right now. Like they're on the next gen right now with the Revelto or whatever the heck you pronounce it, but damn, they just look so good. I love them. And yeah, that will probably be it for this meet. The fin and tonic, there it is, right up on there. Oh, and the FF is rolling out and a Porsche 911 is rolling in. They just keep coming out, coming back in. But yeah, that'll probably be it for this video. Hell yeah, we got a poll. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and goodbye.